Jackson Valley here with Cobalt Banker, Islands Realty, here to get into why are very few people selling their home at the moment? Or on the flip side, why is inventory of real estate so low? And it's not just like, hey, we're seeing this in just Vermont or just Grand Isle County, Chittenden County, Franklin County. No, we're seeing this in the whole entire United States. And people will ask me, when when is this gonna change? When is this gonna break? When are we gonna go back over to a, a balanced market, a buyer's market? And to be honest, I don't have that answer for you. And I'm sure very few people to almost nobody has that exact time frame or answer for you. But what I can tell you is the reason that this is all going on is because people, homeowners that purchased in 2021 in that time frame or even earlier on when you get locked in at an interest rate at 3.5 or around that range or anywhere below six, six and a half, seven percent, it's very hard for you to make that financial decision to go, okay, I'm gonna sell this property and get into this other property, say if it's a similar size property in a similar market, so you're buying another property at similar price, you're just paying more every single month for the same size property and it just doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Or even you could, you could move into the same market and buy something smaller and still be paying the same amount in monthly payments. So that's what's stalling a lot of people, keeping a lot of people who maybe are thinking about, you know, we wanna sell, but it just doesn't make sense for us right now. And then what we're also seeing is, you know, inventory is not like we have zero, zero inventory. Stuff's still coming on the market and you're always gonna see that because we have the people who are in condos, townhomes, small single families, and they're building a family and they're slowly growing out of the space. They need to make that decision to upgrade into a bigger home just because it makes sense for them and their family. Or then we have people who are becoming older, they have too much space, maybe it's just two of them, they have a big home and they're like, we need to downgrade. They say they have a good amount of equity, they get a lot of equity from selling that home and then they can put it into something smaller. So we're always gonna see those two sides of real estate, which is always gonna keep some force, some sort of inventory coming on. But really to answer your question, the only way we are gonna see this start to change and shift is once interest rates come down and people are comfortable selling and hopping into that range of interest rate, wherever it will be within these next months, year, still yet to see, but I just wanted to throw that out there for you, just let you know, this is why very few homes are coming on the market. And you know, right now is the, is the busy real estate season here in Vermont. So I'm sure as summer goes along, we'll keep seeing changes. Perhaps, hopefully more inventory will continue to come on. But for now, that is what we're seeing. I'm just here delivering the information to you. So as always, thank you guys. I appreciate you guys. And as always, let's all be great. Thank you.